I thought I was going to see Ian McKellen today. Apparently, I'm going to see Pokemon Jukebox. Doesn't really matter. We've got to fight this chick. I want to hear what. Until the guild stepped in, I was. Are you ready? Yes. Excellent. Follow me <coughs> and we'll get you ready for your next match. And we're fighting fair as well. And she said she'd teach me something if I beat her. Victory and a pair of unique blades stands between Tiger Lifts the Mountain and the Bronze Division Championship. I've got a stick. It glows. That paralyzing palm is fucking amazing. That paralyzing palm is broken as fuck. Unless I turn the difficulty up. <laughs> Kana's winning streak has been broken at last. I don't know if you've heard, but Kana has proclared that the first fighter who extricates her from her championship will learn the secrets of her technique. Stop doing that to words. Oh, sire, Pimir Sokart, Ayawe. Uh, the crowd loved that fight. I think it was worth some extra silver, don't you? Come now. The arena works on a strictly regenerated payment system for the fights. There's no way I can give you extra. I'll do it, friend. Too savvy a businessman to not reward your staff performers. I'm sorry, but there's no room for bonuses, extra payments, or gratitudes of any kind. You'll be fine with the usual winning. Boo! I tried. Now that that's settled, what else? Tell me about my next fight. Now that you are champion of the bronze division, the Silver Division awaits. It seems that, indirectly, the Serpent has decided to keep your career interesting. A demon has been added to the regular roster since your earlier victory. And since you've shown aptitude, I'm letting you face him first. A demon? Oh dear. This is indeed an honor, though it will not be easy. Are you ready to defeat this horror? Nope. If that's the decision you want to make, is Let's talk some more about Black Whirlwind's history here. Your large friend there was once a competitor here, so I know him in passing, you might say. This is his business, though. Okay, uh, fuck off. Um, how do you feel about this, hapless hon? I watched your last match. That was quite the fight out there. The champion of the bronze division, no less. You're doing very well for someone so new to this place. I think you just have to. If you to haven't do talked silver. to Connie yet, do so. She swore to teach her style to the first person to defeat her. I think you only have to do silver, but I'd like to try and do gold. Looks like you're still walking after that last match. Too bad. But obviously, I'm crap at this game. If you think defeating Kana impresses me, you're wrong. Dude, nothing will she impress She was you. too wrapped up in honor and duty to do well anywhere but in schools in this arena. <clears throat> Unbending values like hers come from having your sword rammed too far up your nether regions. My cloaca? If you can't bend without cutting yourself on morality, you're no good in a real fight. I'll talk to you later, soldier. Good. Go bother someone else. Come on, you respect me, soldier. You respect me. Hey, Dr. Ram. Well, I cannot see you. You Are you here? Yeah, she's got nothing to say, so we talk to Sung Boo. If you want to talk, Brother Bo is better at it than I am. Okay, we'll talk to Bo. Look who stands before us, brothers. Brother. The newest it's champion of the Bronze long. Division. We shall have to keep an eye on you. Very few climb so far, so quickly. Uh, 
That's all I need. I just want updated dialogue. Hey, sweet poison, Lynn. What do you need from me? Um, show me what you have to Magi sell. I really want thousand cut style. I don't think I've got enough to Dude, even if I sell everything, I won't be able to afford it. Happy endings. I'm sorry, but uh, let's have a chat with Lucky Cho. You had your chance to deal with me, and you. Uh, let's talk to Crimson Carter. What's a warrior knock a walker up on the Apawa Fasson Seer to your wall? I have been thinking since our match. I came to this place seeking honor, but I feel that my many victories have all been hollow. You could join my crew? <coughs> Excuse me. I think, yes, it is time for me to leave again and seek other challenges. Uh, what will you do now? Excuse me again. Fucking hell. I think I shall return to the prosperous east and continue my studies. But first, I am sworn to teach the... Jesus. Fuck. Sworn to teach the secrets of my style to any who can best me. Let me instruct you. Sata kwa weir ni wosa weir sawa weira suir cook. Since you told me the serpent's plan. <coughs> oh my god. What the hell? <coughs> Excuse me, I'm sorry. I will teach you a more advanced technique. The key is balance and form. Your motion must be swift, swift but precise. Jesus fuck. <laughs> <coughs> Fucking hell, what the hell, man? I'm on holiday, don't do this to me. Well done, you learn very quickly. One thing bothers me about your moves, though. Throughout the fight, I felt as if there was some opening in your defence. Everyone keeps saying this. Why wouldn't you exploit that opening? Well, if we are uk sunork dano we na wafta tasi yeruk, on we pifu. What I sensed was some opening in your guard. I cannot name it and could not find it, leading me to believe that it was a brilliant gambit. Your method traps your opponents into hunting for a weakness they'll never find. You should speak with your master about this, for now you are deadly enough. Others have mentioned this. Should I be concerned? I am concerned. Consider it a perfectly laid trap, not a weakness. Your master was truly skilled to mould such a trap into your very being. It is odd he never mentioned it to you. Sometimes the best masters dare not trust their students with the deepest mysteries. Certain lessons can only be learned if one discovers them for oneself. I hope you fare well. I turn my eyes to the east where new challenges await me by the ocean. We got the Crimson Tears. Um, is that a style or is that a weapon? Crimson Tears. Uh, it, it's it's her swords. She gave us her her swords. Uh, interesting. Interesting. Uh, key the promoter. The Browns Division champion approaches. I hope you're ready for the challenge awaiting you in the Silver Division. Uh, yeah, sure. Remember, Soldier's the champion at this level. He'll be watching you. Dogs nipping at my heels aren't worthy of watching. What do you need? It's a better side quest than the fucking one in, in Final Fantasy VII, because you can't save it. Tell me about my next fight. Now that you are champion of the Browns Division, the Silver Division awaits. 
It seems that, indirectly, the serpent has decided to keep your career interesting. A demon has been added. Yes. Next. Let's punch this demon. With my, uh... Yeah! I thought she was going to teach me an ability, not how to fight with will her swords. Will the demon rend flesh from bone, or will a lone warrior prove stronger? Oh, it's a heffalump. We're dead. We're, we're dead. When you're ready to try that match again, the fit. Uh, but when have I ever been able to fight the elephants? Ever. Yeah! Will the demon rend flesh from bone, or will a lone warrior prove stronger? Can you not? Oh my god! <laughs> I hate these fucking elephants. Oh my god. Uh, undefeated, eh? And undefeated. Simply. Ah, uh, just, just do it again. I f if, if there was two of us, this would be fair. It's not fair. <laughs> will the demon rend flesh from bone, or will a lone warrior prove stronger? Third time's a charm. I think. Oh my god! Oh my god! Just let me have a little hissy fit. Let me have a little hissy fit there. Okay, okay, I'm having a hissy fit. I'm having a hissy fit. Simply. <laughs> Fuck this. I don't want to fight the demon. He's immune to all my good will stuff. Will the demon rend flesh from bone, or will a lone warrior prove stronger? I will turn the difficulty down, son. I can't judge him. I cannot judge the distance. Oh, yeah. 
I can't judge where it is to hit him. Like... I can't, like, you'd think hit, you'd hit him in the fucking trunk, but it's not. It's the torso behind the trunk, as far as I can tell there. So, where I think I'm Simply hitting him, I'm not. Let's just fucking keep going. It's been 20 him. minutes. Let's fight the demon. I don't care anymore. don't even want to play the game. There's other ways I can get into this will fight. Will the demon rend flesh from bone, or will a lone warrior prove stronger? Oh, he's already rendered flesh from bone, what, like, nine times? Fresh from blow? <laughs> Like... It's not. Hitting the trunk is not hurting him. He is a bit... Broke my guard. I need healing. Dodge! That should have hit him! Why is it not hitting it? Can, can, can you not see this? I'm hitting him with my big stick and it's not hitting him. It's going through its trunk and then like not hitting him. Come on. Fuck me. Tell me about my next fucking fight. Jesus Christ. I don't care anymore about your stupid cunting arena. You fucking ass wipes. Will the demon rend flesh Let me skip bone, this. Or will a lone warrior prove stronger? Right. No. Two. Why is that not hitting him? Why is it not hitting him? My fucking staff is through him and it's not hitting him. And I'm gonna just, just, just dark side fell. Dark side fell. Sim oh. Jesus. Will the demon rend flesh from bone, or will a lone warrior prove stronger? How are the audience still enjoying this? I'm not, it's not hitting him. I'm hitting him and it's not hitting him. I need healing. It's going right for like if my if my fucking giant blade goes through you and then you claim it misses something is wrong with your game something is very very wrong with your game excuse me one second
points out. That's 15 minutes fighting an elephant. I don't care. Will the demon <laughs> rend flesh from bone, or will a lone warrior prove stronger? I don't care anymore. I don't care. <clears throat> This guy's hitbox is gash. No, he's still bum rushing me. Okay. Look. I hate you, game. I, I genuinely hate you. <laughs> Another demon falls. We shall have to add a new division for you alone if this keeps up. Kylan the Serpent wishes to speak with you personally. This is a rare honor. Do try to be polite. You have already been granted access to the back room of the arena, and the Serpent's private chamber is just off of it. You may as well go now and see what he wants. No, I'm all right. I'm still pretty angry. Oh, and one other thing. The Serpent has requested that you visitate him alone. I know you usually have a friend with you, but they'll have to remain behind for this meeting. We nearly stopped playing this game just then. We nearly stopped playing this game just then. I mean, it's not the first time I've turned the difficulty down for one fight, but, um... Having some... I... What? I'm afraid... Oh. I bet soldiers got We should have told you that Kylan will only see you alone. Yeah, so we're going alone. Be sure to come out ahead of whatever deal he offers you. I'll be with the others if you need me. Genuinely lost my temper then. Like, that wasn't like a rage fake or anything. If I hit you and you don't take damage... It is vital that we talk a moment. Oh, you're not creepy. You handled yourself well against the demonic servitor. It was a rewarding experience for us both, I'm sure. Take this as my thanks. You are a smart young woman. <coughs> smart enough to know that you will get much further as my friend than my foe. You may find that certain opportunities, mutually rewarding arrangements between us, will come your way in the near future. I'm just trying to infiltrate the barracks, man. Uh, if you're proposing I cheat or throw fights, I refuse! Cheat is such a pedestrian term. I prefer to think of myself as a creative engineer. Like the fountains that channel water throughout the land, I spread entertainment to the people. Right now is an interesting time for an organization known as the Guild. I've no doubt that Kui has told you about us, if you didn't already know. Our organization is involved in many different activities, most of which operate below the view of the authorities of this great empire. A bunch of criminals. Come now. We're above calling each other names, aren't we? The Guild, you see, has recently developed a vacancy in its upper echelons. A man by the name of Gao the Greater has been killed, and with his death, a new leader must be chosen. I intend to replace him in that role, and I need good people to back me. You realize that I'm the one who eliminated Gao the Greater? Did you? An interesting claim, and one I'm not sure I believe. You don't match the description we have of the killer, but then the descriptions are fairly tenuous. If you are the one who killed Gao, then I owe you a favor. 
Consider my reluctance to turn you into the Lotus Assassins a repayment for that debt in full. <laughs> I don't care. There is the matter, however, of your friend, Whirlwind. I'm sure you know that he was one of the fighters here and that he left the arena. But do you know why? You asked him to throw a fight? He won't tell me. He has good reason not to tell you about this part of his admittedly spotty past. Whirlwind's past is certainly a colourful one. Did he tell you that he was thrown out of the arena? No, I've not really talked to him, to be honest. Public displays of rage and drunkenness, uttered threats of murder, excessive violence, property damage, and I believe several charges of defecating in public. <laughs> that sounds about right. They don't already know, I can accept him as he is. If you trust him, you are a fool. The Black Whirlwind is an impressive fighter, but he is better avoided than confronted. We couldn't let him fight as he was, so he left. His brother, Raging Ox, wisely stayed Ooh, here and they went were brothers. to become champion. They were brothers. Brother! You could reach that point yourself, you know. Indeed, that's a distinct possibility. Why do you sound drunk? To become champion yourself, you will need my support. That means you and I will work together closely. I am Wu the Lotus Blossom. I want nothing to do with you, Serpent. You place yourself in a precarious position, my young friend. I would hate to see your career stagnate. Mm hmm. And I would you hate see to see your insides. What is that noise? On the outside! Hey, you can't. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Serpent, I'll kill you where you stand. No, you won't, Whirlwind. Just like last time, you will leave. I can see that this polite discussion has concluded, as so many do, in your odorous presence. We may talk again, perhaps. We're leaving now. You and I have to talk alone. It's important. Interesting. You'd best not be screwing me over. I'm really worried one of them is going to screw me over. Look, you can't trust Kylon. I know he was probably offering you the world, or maybe all the wine in it if he were really crafty, but... You didn't honestly think you were going to slip down here after that little display, did you, Whirlwind? Oh, you're so dead. If you came down Step here on your back, own... Cho. For once in my life, I've got something important to tell someone. You have nothing important to say, you lummox. You've embarrassed Kylon the Serpent, and I'm going to make sure you never get a chance to repeat your performance. I've been waiting for this. Time to cut off the Serpent's tail! Sweet! <laughs> Unlock. Oh. Dude was pretty fucking burly, to be honest. Are you alright? Better than I've been in a while. 
All this best behavior when you're in the city business was wearing on my nerves. Not the first time I've gone up against one of Kai Lan's thugs, you know. Not at all. What do you mean? Remember I told you I used to fight in the arena? Well, I was the best there was. Then my brother came to the city and decided he joined the arena too. The arena was about the same as it is now. Kui and Kai Lan were there and Lucky Cho too. But he was just a runt back then. Uh, is your brother still fighting? My brother became the arena champion. The Raging Ox. They said he retired. But he didn't retire. He was killed. I should know. I'm the one who killed him. Oh, dude, no. Why did you kill him? Raging Ox was one of Kailan's men. Well, he wasn't always. Kailan approached me first. And when I turned him down, he went to my brother instead. When Ox joined up with Kailan, I stopped getting good matches. Ox was fighting his way to becoming champion. They're doing a little work for the guild on the side. Dude. Must have made things awkward. He was so cocksure and wouldn't listen to his older brother. Once he fell in with Kailan, he stopped talking to me. Soon Ox became Kailan's enforcer and carried out his bidding. He'd skulk around in robes so no one would know the arena champion was a common thug. One night, I followed Ox back to Kai Lan's. I was drunk and I was mad. I just wanted to tell Ox how dangerous Kai Lan was. Convince him to leave. But Kai Lan was there. He tried to interfere. I attacked him. And Ox tried to stop me. When it was over, Ox was dead. And my axe was covered in his blood. Jesus. What happened then? Kai Lan just stood there, smiling. I would have killed him if I wasn't so stunned. After that, I left. For the first time in my life, I ran. I ran, and then I drank myself into a stupor that lasted for half a year. Jesus. He truly is a serpent. You do what you have to in the arena. Just don't fool yourself about working with a serpent. Lucky Cho's death just put you on the Serpent's Wanted list. I'd really like to see Kailan's face if you become Arena Champion. Of course, I'd rather just kill him. Come on, let's go. What? What do you want? Have you ever considered settling down? Tried that once, and it didn't work out. Prefect Mu Hong pledged his daughter Mi Shan to me after I cleared his district of bandits. She wasn't ugly, so I agreed. <laughs> the night of the wedding feast, I got more than a little drunk, and in the morning, I woke up in the prefect's bed next to the prefect's wife. <laughs> You're a beast, Wildwind. I got up and went into my bride's room, and there was a strange man in her bed. I killed the bastard and was about to kill her when Mishan came into the room yelling. Apparently, I had just killed her sister's husband and was about to kill her sister. I tried to tell her it was an honest mistake, but she wouldn't hear it. You killed your wife's brother-in-law by mistake? The brother-in-law's family was pissed, and so was the prefect when he found out about his wife. They tried to subdue me so they could send me to prison. I killed them all swiftly. None of them suffered. Still, Mishan wouldn't leave with me. She kept crying and complaining <laughs> about her family. Jesus, family man. Family life just isn't for me. Jesus, calm the fuck down. What are your thoughts on our situation? Nothing's changed since the last time you asked me. Unless I passed out. Did I pass out? No, how could I? I haven't been drinking. That's all for now. Whatever.